guys. So today wasn't my day. Well, last night wasn't my my night. Um, I got back from school. I went picked up the ECU, and I installed the ECU. Did the switch, did the key, everything. The car did not start. So I was totally bummed out last night. I went to sleep like at two o'clock in the morning, doing research, see what the fuck was going on, and I still couldn't find anything. So today is Friday morning. Um, I'm gonna have to do something I didn't want to do. So I'm gonna right, going out to U-Haul, pick up a truck and a trailer since our truck is being used. Um, I'm gonna go pick up a truck and a trailer, come back to the garage, load the car on the trailer, and take it to the dealership. I didn't want to take it to the dealership because I know they're gonna give me a headache with the car, but we're gonna go do that now. Me and Christian are gonna go pick up the truck. I switched the this, the, the ignition switch back to my stop, the one that I had first. And left the 07 ECU to see if they could program it like that because I heard it. The car was giving me a whole bunch of problems last night, so that's the reason why I didn't record it. But um, you guys are a day behind. This video is going to be posted Saturday, and then Friday, which is today, I'm going to post the video from Thursday. But it's, I'm a little behind on the video uploading. But bear with me, guys. I'm trying to get this car good and trying to get this car ready, but it's not working. Every time I want to finish something and something always happens. So I'm totally bummed out. I'm on my way now. Well, I'm going to get on my way now to uh, to U-Haul, pick up the truck and the trailer, and hopefully we can get this thing done today. But if not, um, I don't know what to do anymore. I'm totally bummed out. I'm at the point of just selling the car, which I don't want to do, but hopefully, hopefully today I get that done and we take it to Jason to get the base map done. We registered the, the flash already um, with my name, all my information. Have we got to program into the car and put the base map in so the car can actually start. But please pray that this works. Alright guys, so I'll catch you guys in a little bit. Good night, baby. Ay, sí, que bonito, eh. Beautiful. Mira que la mierdita ahí. ¿Eh? ¿Eh? No. ¿Dónde está? ¿Eh? Está allá abajo. The 10, the, what they're asking now is 8 for the auto transport. If you're leaving it on, you hit accept. Bring <coughs> $10 on the truck as well. Now that's $150 deductible. Versus going through your insurance in case you're damaged. It's not there yet. I know. Come with us ahead. Broke. Oh, very high. You're not. You're not. I am. You want to grab me? First one in spot. He's your top of the visor. Okay. What are you? Alright guys, so we just picked up the U-Haul now. Um, we're gonna head over to the garage, try to load everything up quick as possible because we're already running late for the appointment we made at the dealer. But I'm on my way now. I got the dolly and the long ass truck. This shit's long as fuck. And Chris is behind me in the Accord. So I'll uh, catch you guys when we get to the garage. Alright, we just got the TSX loaded up on the dolly. Listen, never put white wheels on a dolly. Look how sketchy this is, guys. This side is perfectly in. Hey, can, can I make that one too? Perfect. Alright. So we're about to head out now. To the Honda dealership. Hopefully they don't give me a hard time. Me at the telephone? 
Hopefully they don't give me a hard time. Hopefully we can get this shit started. About to pull off in this dickhead over here. Left the freaking ramps out. We dragged the ramp for like three feet. Demon. Demon. Hey, hey, he can't even put this shit on. Chevy I know. <laughs> huh? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Jesus, fabrication of piping? Yeah. Unbelievable. Good welds. First start inside the garage after we got the base map on and the ECU set up. Not a good idea.
right, guys, we just brought the car back to the garage, and I'm not gonna lie. Christian. Christian, how do you feel? Eh? How do you feel in the car? <laughs> nah, we're actually, even though we don't look it, but we're very excited. Um, the car's actually base map. Jason, thank you. Appreciate that. Angel, thank you for sending me to Jason. Um, the car's actually base map and, <laughs> and running good. It's um, not ready to be driven. I can do all the little touches I gotta do, but um, it's good. It's good. Uh, we went to a Honda. We got the, the key reprogrammed to the ECU. Everything's good. Um, yeah. All right, we're gonna finish up. We're gonna take the, the truck back to U-Haul now and come back and hopefully finish up the car to see when we can schedule to get it tuned. I gotta do, well, we still gotta do the clutch line because I forgot to get, I forgot to get the, the fittings that I had to get at Lowe's or where the fuck we're gonna get it. Probably AutoZone, I don't know. If I can't find them at Lowe's, I'm gonna get them at AutoZone because Angel doesn't have them. But I'm gonna get those and hopefully we get to bleed the brakes and the car should be done. Hey, Dan. Hey, Christian. Hey, Christian. Hey, Christian. Ugly ass nigga. All right, guys. So we're gonna go ahead, head over to U-Haul now, and I'll catch you guys a little bit. So I'm sorry you guys didn't get to catch up with the rest of our adventures. Um, I actually instead of going to Lowe's, I spoke to Angel and Angel had the fittings that I needed for the clutch line. So we went to Angel Built, bought food at Sonic. Um, then I went home. Christian left, and I did the clutch line. I bled the clutch line with mass cylinder, slave cylinder, and um, I did the brakes as well. I bled the 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 uh, uh, the brakes. My bad. <laughs> Sorry, it's been a long day. But I bred the blakes. The hell. I bred. I bled the brakes. Alright, I bled the brakes. And honestly, I double checked everything. I still have a small leak coming from my wastegate. So I'm not building boosts exactly. And the car, since the base map is on, it doesn't pass like three or four grand. But. Honestly, after six months of that car sitting and after six months of me putting countless time into it and stressing out, being angry and all this other stuff, I'm not gonna lie, I got emotional. I actually did got to take the car for a ride around the block. The car has been registered this whole entire time. This whole entire time the car has been being worked on, the car has been registered and I was actually able to um, take it for a ride for the first time in like six months that it's been there. and I'm not, I got a little emotional. Um, you guys seen the video? I took it around the block twice. Didn't get to step on it, but you guys seen it was throwing five balls out because it was uh, after three games it just starts like not it's not misfiring, but I don't know exactly. But <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to say. I'm happy. Today went from being a shitty day to being one of the best days I ever had, 
and thank you to all you guys. Thank you, Angel Built. Thank you, Jason. Thank you, Christian, for being there and helping me out. Thank you to everybody that's been there since day one helping me out. The car's almost done. Just need a few, check over a few more things, try to get the wastegate situation taken care of, and then we'll be over at Evans Tune and get the car tuned. But I'm sorry this video's long. I'm sorry I'm posting this video the next day, not the same day. But thank you for all the support one more time. I appreciate everything you guys do for me. I appreciate all, all the support you guys give me and the car and the channel and the merchandise I give you, everything. Um, I'll be back to posting more videos, not every day, but at least three or four times a week. So you guys don't forget about me and just keep showing your support. So I'll, keep, I'll catch you guys probably tomorrow or the next day, whenever I get to do something else. But once again, thank you all. Thank you for all the support and stay blessed, guys.